How to hook up your discharge line couldn't be easier. If you live in the north, you're not going to have a check valve. So you're going to have just this rubber coupler. We already screw clamped one side to the PVC that's stubbed out. That's the plumbing to your pump. You need a 5 16th nut driver. Standard. You go ahead and just loosen the clamp because we we don't you know have it really really tight. It's just we don't want it to fall off in shipping. Now I highly recommend this PVC that we use. One of the uh, car tire companies makes it. You want to talk about indestructible. And that's it. And one of the reasons why I love this black discharge, it's Schedule 40, but it can go any direction. So people, a lot of times they get concerned and they say, I need the plumbing to be stubbed out here. Well, internally that's not possible, but you have just endless, endless amount of room. Let me show you. So you see how we're bending this to go wherever we want? So don't let that bother you that you feel your discharge line's running in another direction than the two pumps in a duplex. This is a duplex model right here. And I can literally take our black, which is God is strong and it's it's wonderful. I love working with it too. It's got extra give, extra flex, but you can go in any direction as you can see. In the south, you're going to get a check valve. You want to install it so that the arrows are pointing away from your sump pump system. Okay, there's an arrow here and an arrow here. You can see the arrows. Go ahead and put that like that. You want the arrows going away from the unit. So now take a 5 16th nut driver. Just go ahead, remove the clamp, and just slide it over the stubbed PVC. Then take some soapy water if you want. Not too much soap in there, just or possibly just wet it just so that you can get this easily onto the stubbed PVC. Then go ahead take the clamp. You might have to loosen it a little more like I'm doing here. Here we go. I got my 5 16 nut driver. All right, so now to connect the discharge line, I always recommend, so we gotta loosen this. We'll put it right there. And I always recommend our black flex PVC. I just love it. And you might have to do the exact same thing, put a little water. You want to put just a small amount of soap. And then you just work it back and forth until you get it on. Now you go ahead and tighten the stainless steel screw clamp. Okay, and you never have to worry about what direction the stub is on these outdoor units because the flex 
Schedule 40, this is a lot easier to work with than the white. That's for a spa and pool. So we order this in. In my 35 years as a contractor, we progressively went deeper and we were building sumps larger in diameter to displace more water. As an industry, on a whole, this is what we did. And you know what? We got it wrong. One day I said, there's got to be an easier way. And that's when I started working on a horizontal sump station where it displaces more water than a 30-inch round, 6-foot deep sump pit. This is a first. A duplex lift station, fully plumbed for the DIY and contractor to put in any situation that demands a lift station sump pump system. This is not indoor material. This is not a cheap, flimsy basin. This is heavy, dual wall, culvert pipe. This is custom welded, custom made with an extended horizontal chamber that'll give you 80% less cycling of your sump pump, extending the life of the sump pump system. This will handle sheet water off the roof, sheet water off the driveway, your neighbor's yard water, your yard water. You can't build a yard drain system using indoor basins. It just doesn't work. It fails. This is a state-of-the-art, fully patented, everything about it. There's a handful of patents that go along with this. This is an exclusive, handmade, dual pump, duplex lift station that'll handle 10 inches of rain per hour. Nothing has ever been built like this before. Nothing has ever been made ready to set in the ground. Just dig a hole, install it, and you're all set. For the DIY and contractor, this is an industry first. This is a game changer.